Hey YouTube, this is Jaden Storm coming at you from Team Shadow Strike, and I have a new video that I was going to try. I've seen some people do um, random pack openings, so that's kind of what this is. I have 11 random packs here. This is a mix from um, me buying some packs and packs that I won from taking first place at my locals on Monday. Um, so I literally just looked at all the packs that we had, and I grabbed 11 random packs, and um, so I'm going to open those up here for you guys. Um, I don't know if this is something you guys would want to see. I just thought I would try it, you know, cause I've seen people do it in the past. Some people like it. Some people don't. So I just thought I would give this a try. And if this is something that you guys like, I will do it more occasionally, um, or more often. Um, so if this is something you do, uh, want to see more of in the comment section below, please tell me. So anyway, I literally, like I said, I have 11 random packs. So, um, I have, um, I have, well, you know what? I'm not going to tell you. I'm just going to give these a quick shuffle here. So, and then we're just going to open them up and see what we get. Hopefully we'll get something good. Okay. First pack. We're going to be opening a pack of set eight BTO eight blue storm armada. Maybe we'll get a maelstrom. All right, let's see. We got some Cyber Ninja. Nah. Nah. Ew. And a Wing Dragon slash Tarot. Tachikaze. All right, that was kind of terrible. Next, we're going to open up a pack of BT10 Triumphant Return of the King of Knights. So, let's see. We got Spike Brother, Eradicators, uh, Nova Grapplers, Liberators, and Fast Chase Liberator Josephus. This is actually not a bad card to get right now, considering you can play them in Blue Flames, so not a bad card. Next, we're going to be going a little old school here. We're going to open up a pack of BTO2 Onslaught of Dragon Souls. These older packs, you know, uh, there's a couple cards out there that you can pull that are actually worth quite a bit of money. Like the Grand Blue Perfect, I think, came in this pack, but we'll see. First card, Knight of Truth Gordon. Uh, MGM Prototype. Skeleton Lookout. Gatling Claw, that's actually a good pull. And Gigatech Charger. Yeah, I remember playing this card sometimes, but hey, Gatling Claw is not a bad pull, right? Um, looks like we got, I got two packs of set two, so let's see, uh, we're going to open up another pack of Onslaught of the Dragon Souls, so here we go. Okay, we got, uh, what is that? Evil Shade. Uh, One Who Gazes at the Truth. Uh, Phantom Black. A Piece of Shit. And holy shit, that's a Soul Saver Dragon. That is awesome. Soul Saver Dragon, this brings back a lot of nostalgia factor because Soul Saver was my first major deck that I played. Um, this is really, really cool, bringing back a lot of memories. That is nostalgia for you. This was the first uh, best deck that I played, which was Barkle Soul Saver. That is awesome. That, 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 that makes this worth it. That is awesome. Awesome, 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 awesome. Soul Saver Dragon. All right. Um, next we're going to open a pack of BTO3 Demonic Lord Invasion. What will we pull? Man, that makes me happy. Soul Saver Dragon, that is awesome. Alright, we got, um, Prisoner Beast. Uh, that grade 2 version of that ride chain that no one liked, or at least I didn't like it. Uh, Dragon Dancer Loudress? When this unit attacks, if the number of rear guard... Oh, I never even remember that card. Uh, a Tachikaze Critical Trigger, and... The hell? Bloody Calf. Dark Irregular. Piece of shit. Okay. Next, we're going to open a pack of BT-12 Binding Force of the Black Rings. Soul Saver Dragon. That, that is awesome. 
Ugh, I'm sorry, guys. You, Soul Saver Dragon, I'm sorry. I just freaking love Soul Saver's artwork. Okay. All right, here we go. We got um, Overcast Liberator Geraint. Uh, Hell's Draw. Uh, Demon World Caster. Demon World Castle Zerschlong. Zerdick. Yeah, Zerdick. Um, that is a Revenger Stand Trigger. And Homing Eradicator Rochishin. Eh. Next, we're going to open up a pack of the first pack, BTO1, Descendant of the King of Knights. Okay, I have two packs of this. Imagine us pulling a Barkle. Wouldn't that be fucking epic? We get Barkle and Soul Saver. Okay, so here we go. First pack of BTO1. And I'm not looking at this, guys. So, at least I'm doing my best to. I haven't seen any of them yet. All right. We have a Hungry Dumpty, Oracle Guardian Gemini, uh, Rock the Wall, uh, Lizard Soldier Ganlu, and Mr. Invincible. Ha ha ha. Eh, nothing too spectacular. Alright, next we're going to be opening up a pack of Fighters Collection 2014. This one's not really exciting, you know, because, hello, I mean, every card in here is a rare, right? Um, Eradicator Thunder Dragon, that's actually not a bad one to pull. Uh, that Link Joker one that turns your grade 3s into boosters and intercepts, I think, yeah. Eh. And, uh, Halberd Revenger Purder. Hmm, that's not bad, I guess. What does this guy even do? Counterblast 1, choose two of your rear guards with their Avenger and its card name and retire them. When this unit attacks the Vanguard, you may pay the cost. If you do, this unit gets plus 10k and one crit until the end of battle. Wow, that's actually not bad. And then E-Special Counterblast 1 card with Revenger in its name. When this unit is placed on the Vanguard, you may pay the cost. If you do, search your deck for one grade 1 or less card. You may search your deck for up to one grade 1 or less card. Call it to regard the same column as this. That's actually not bad. It's actually not a bad card. Okay. All right, we have three packs left, and next we're going to be opening a pack of Seal Dragon Unleashed, BT-11. So. Um, Tachikaze. Uh, Tachikaze. <laughs> um, Angel Feather. Uh, that is a Ancient Dragon something. And uh, Myth Guard La Superba. Okay. Okay, so far all we've gotten is Soul Saver. But hey, that, that makes it worth it in its own, right? Next, we're going to be opening up a pack of Catastrophic Outbreak. BT-13, one of my favorites. Uh, we got... Dragon Cord Corrupt Dragon. We got Aqua Force. We got... I think that's Tachikaze. Nope, it's Nubatama. Um, Nova Grappler and Wheel Assault. Man, I was hoping we'd get at least two double rare or higher. Alright, we got one pack left. One pack left of BT-01, Descendant of the King of Knights. We're going to start, we're going to end with the beginning of Vanguard as we saw it. So here we go, opening up the last pack. Wingull! Dragon Monk Gojo! Uh, Butterfreeze Mega Evolution! A Mouse! And the King of Sword. Wow, we didn't do so hot. We opened 10 packs and all we got was one triple rare. I guess that's not bad. Um, but oh well, this was fun, guys. I pull, um, I got a uh, Soul Saver Dragon. That 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 right there made it worth it. Oh my god, just look. I, 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 I'm going to try and find a build that I can still play Soul Saver in. I mean, I just love Soul Saver Dragon. Um, but look, look at that. But other words, you know... Um, I guess the Dragon Monk Gojo is not a bad pull for all the frickin' Cogro decks I built. Um, Fast Chase Liberator Josephus, not bad. Um, uh, 
Gatling Claw, that's not bad. Um, but, oh well, um, you know, pulled a Soul Saver Dragon. You know, I mean, uh, not really that useful today, but you know what, it's just nice to look at it, you know. I'm, you know what, I, I take that back. I am going to find a way to make Soul Saver still playable. So, anyway, guys, um... So, there you go, guys. I hope you enjoyed this as much as I enjoyed bringing it to you. Um, if you would like to see more random pack openings like this, and, you know, maybe next time we'll get more than just one uh, triple rare, um, let me know. I'll do more of these. This was fun. You know, I enjoyed this, even though um, I wish we would have gotten at least one more good card besides Soul Saber Dragon. But, um, hey, you know, the, the nostalgia factor alone pulling this, that, that I can't argue with. Um... I was actually hoping I was talking to my friend Ryan on my way home over the phone, and I was like, you know what, I, I'm going to pull a Wyvern Guard Bree out of the pack. Because, a little secret, guys, I didn't pull any Wyvern Guard Brees out of, like, two boxes that I got when set two came out. Because um, I was building, I was basically getting all my cargo stuff together, and I, I had to literally order my Brees. Um, I had to literally buy them online when they were $25 a piece. So I basically had to pay $100 just to get four perfects. And now I have, like, four play sets. But anyway, um, if you would like to see more random pack openings, please let me know. And I will do more of them. This was a lot of fun. Um, I'm, I am I want to do more of them, but if uh, you guys just... If you guys don't give me any kind of positive response, then I just won't do it anymore. But if this is something you guys want to see, please let me know, and I will do so uh, more often. Um, I tried to get a wide variety of packs. Um, but, um, hey... Soul Saver Dragon again. Can't complain. So anyway, guys, in the comment section below, please give me your feedback. Uh, make sure you subscribe to my channel if you already haven't. Um, so thank you very much for watching. Make sure you comment, rate, subscribe, thumbs up this video, and I'll see you next time.